Hello everyone and welcome back to the Hidden Game Room. I'm your host, the Hidden Gamer. Alright, we're back today with another kick up video. Um gonna do a Mario Odyssey video of that uh, Ducker Side of the Moon level, but uh, uh, my camera is just uh, didn't want to spend the time trying to edit it and fix it all in post production, so I just said the heck with it. So anyway, uh, let's get on with this pickup video. Got a huge, well, not huge, but we got a good size lot, good mix lot today. Start with the Game Boy titles. I got um, heavyweight championship boxing for the Game Boy. I got Contra the Alien Wars for the Game Boy. What I'm trying to do is complete my Contra collections of every console, every Contra, Contra released on the console. This one I got, not in the best shape, but Contra, Contra Advance Alien Wars EX for Game Boy Advance. Got C the Contra Adventure for PlayStation uh, disc only. But still, you know, that takes care of the collection. Got one more coming that I don't have, and that's going to be um, to have it on the Saturn. Uh, what's it called? Contra Legacy of War. Have it complete um, for the Saturn, and I got it for the PlayStation. So, not sure when that's going to get here, but when it gets here, and it should complete my Contra collection, then we'll do a video just on that. Uh, Rayman Legends Definitive Edition for the Nintendo Switch. It's pretty good. I've only played through like one level of it, but still, it's pretty fun. I haven't played the other versions of that game. I know it's on about every other system, but I haven't got to it. Um, so you got Exodus for the Atari 7800. Got a new, no, not new, but um, new for me, a new Atari 7800 controller. So that completes my Atari 7800. Um, I got it at the pawn shop. So now I, get, I have, I think, three games for it. Got the controller, got the hookups. So I'll be able to start playing that pretty soon. Um, so let's see what else we got here. Any more PlayStation? No, no PlayStation. Well, PS4, but no. Where's PS3. Alright, uh, so let's do the Super Nintendo. NCAA Basketball for Super Nintendo. Got Kablooey for the Super Nintendo. Got let's see. Williams Arcade's Greatest Hits for the Super Nintendo. John Madden Football 93 for the Super Nintendo. Let's see, let's skip that one to last. Um, Izzy's Quest for the Olympic Rings for the Super Nintendo. And this is one that I thought I had and can't believe I didn't. I was actually looking through. I have all the other three um, of these series on the Super Nintendo but I didn't have this one this was the first one I can't believe I didn't have it um, WWF Super Wrestlemania so I have this one I have Royal Rumble I have the arcade game and I forget what that third one is uh, but yeah that gives me all four of them <clears throat> bases loaded second season for the Nintendo picked that up. I think it was 50 cents or something like that I mean if I'm at the store even if and I already have that game but if I see games that even if I already have them if they're less than a dollar or a dollar or less I'm gonna pick them up you know nothing else I can either give them away or sell them or something but yeah anytime I'll, I'll pick them up doesn't matter um so uh <coughs> excuse me <coughs> for the PS3 Young Justice Legacy so Justice League Legacy Edition for the PS3. 
Let's see, where am I gonna put that one? Probably stand it up. Lay it down over there. Um dun, dun, dun. Let's see, I'm trying to keep these somewhat in order here. That's the only one I got for the 360. Alright. History Channel Legends of War Patton for the Xbox 360. Picked that up for a pretty good price. Let's see, let's turn them that way. You can see them. Stack them up, get a super stack going. Uh, let's see. Wipeout 2048 for the PlayStation Vita. Haven't played it yet, but uh, it looks pretty cool. I'll probably do a video on this one. I'm going to do a video on most of these that I'm doing in these pickup videos. You know, I'm just still trying to get some ideas going in my head, you know, of how, as far as what I want to do with the channel, what I want to do. And I'm taking requests. I haven't got any. But, you know, I'll take requests. If I got a game you want to see it, I'll play it. And my, my let's plays are going to be a little different than most. Like, I'm not going to try to show off my my superior gaming skills or anything like that. I'm just going to play it like you would be playing it. Whip it out, not knowing much about it, and go for it. Um, so, anyway. Um, Spy Games Elevator Missions for the Nintendo Wii. Kind of reminds me of the old elevator action for the NES. Um, no idea what this game's about, but picked it up. I'm going to check it out got this one I bought because it was a dollar uh, Madden NFL 11 for the Wii a real introduction needed there now, this one was cool this one I probably overpaid for but you know it's one of those things where you're not gonna see it so you might as well grab it when you can Tetch new shadow assassins for the Wii I love Tetch new on the PlayStation I think I have one and two up there pick that up for the Wii very awesomeness. Yes, awesomeness is a word. Not just for Kung Fu Panda. Oh, for more of my Contra series, uh, Contra 4 for Nintendo DS. Not complete, but it's in box. Missing the manual. So, that's... That, and that, and basically that, those right there completed my Contra collection. Because I already have um, Legacy of War for the Saturn. But, um, just to make sure I have them all, I got it for the PlayStation, because that's all the variants. So, as far as I know, that's every Contra game that they released on the home console. You know, barring digital downloads, because, you know, that's not real games. Um, so, anyway, uh, moving on. Got a big video today, sorry about that, but... Picked up a lot between uh, Black Friday and just some of the sales in general. So we've got some GameCube games here. Batman Dark Tomorrow. That's complete in box. Everything except for the comic. Got instruction book and all that in there. Batman Dark Tomorrow. X2 Wolverine's Revenge for the GameCube. Um, Tom Clancy's The Sum of All Fears for the GameCube. And again, I haven't played any of these. I haven't played any of the games in that stack. The stack here. Play bases loaded to played WrestleMania. I rented that game a lot. That's why I guess that's why I thought I had it. Um, played Exodus on the Nintendo on the NES. Um, Tom and Jerry War of the Whiskers for the GameCube. I believe this is complete. Let me see. Let me open it up. Nope. Missing the instructions. Um, got two of these. I think there was four of these total on the GameCube. I got two of them. Prince of Persia Sands of Time and Prince of Persia Warrior Within for the GameCube. Yeah, I couldn't get the stickers off of the top. I have to work on that a little bit harder. So front and back. Those are both complete in box. I think I have that Warrior Within on PS2, but, you know, it didn't have it on the GameCube. Always looking to go to GameCube stuff, especially right now while it's cheap. Because the GameCube stuff is cheap right now. Back this up, make sure we're getting all this. Usually, 
See, I can't see this camera, so I don't know what it's filming until I get up, get up there and hook it to the computer. But uh, so the computer's not down here in the hidden game room. I'm still trying to build one out. All right, let's see. He's getting mixed up. Okay, bear with me, folks. We're almost done. Geometry Wars 3 Evolve for the Xbox One. Um, it's twenty dollars brand new almost everywhere right now, but didn't want to pay twenty dollars for it. I think I picked this up for eight bucks finally. You, but you know, for eight dollars I'll get it. But it wasn't even worth twenty to me. I don't know what it was new. Um, PS4 Final Fantasy 4 Typo HD Day One Edition. Picked that up. Um, finished off the Mega Man Legacy Collection. Mega Man Legacy 2 for PS2. I think on my other pickup videos I showed the first one. So that was one through six, and this is seven, eight, nine, and ten on here. On the Mega Man's. Uh oh, and here you go. So the last one. Complete inbox, brand new sealed, which it's not gonna be sealed for long because I'm gonna open it. We got Night Trap for the PS4. Limited run games. Oh, they made it. In case you're wondering, this is what they look like. And they do pretty good. I haven't opened it yet. But I will. And we're going to open it up and see what's in here. In fact, we might as well do it now. So, yep, there it is. Night Trap. See, I've never played the original Night Trap. I've heard about it. Wanted to play it. And I didn't want to pay the price nowadays what it cost, you know, when I finally got my Sega CD to play it. So, and it came with this nice little baseball card. Night Trap from Limited Run Games. So that was pretty cool. So. I'm not sure what's in there, but. Uh, do I want to open that on camera now or do I want to? Wait? Tell you what, drop me a line in the comments. If I get enough people, say, just say open it. If you want me to open it, I'll open it. If not, then. I'll just open it and play it and then we'll see how it is. Alright guys, so that do it for this edition of Cheesy Pickups. I think I got everything that I picked up this week. I'm not sure. I'm looking around, looking around. Um now I already did those. Yep, yep, I believe this is everything. So anyway, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and be on the lookout for those giveaway videos. I'll catch y'all at the next one. Peace.